In Creo 11, there is multi-body support for the shrink wrap feature. When you create shrink wrap features, you can now collect bodies from the source assembly to add to the target part. In the following, this will be illustrated using a small assembly consisting of nine parts. One of those parts contains two solid bodies, as we can see from a quick search that we perform in the model tree. We then create a shrink wrap feature in a new part and use the option Auto Collect All Solid Geometry. This option now enables you to collect solid bodies as the resulting geometry type, in addition to the previously available method to create quilts. When the resulting geometry is bodies, you can further choose between the following copying methods. Firstly, you can copy all bodies from the source part to the target part as separate objects. This is set by the option Keep as separate objects and simply transfers all bodies of the source parts one to one to the target part. The resulting bodies keep their name and construction attributes. Also material assignments and body parameters are transferred for each body. The second method involves merging all bodies from the same source part. When you set the option merge all in part, each resulting body represents the solid geometry of one source part. As a result, there's a one-to-one -one relationship between source parts and resulting bodies. Creo therefore uses the name of the source part to name the resulting body. With this copying method, the material, parameters and construction attributes are transferred from the first body in the source part. The third method involves merging all bodies from all source parts. All resulting geometry is added to one body. The body options tab becomes available and allows you to add the resulting geometry to an existing body or to create a new body. In situations where bodies cannot be merged, you can choose to create a successful feature when you select the leave as separate objects if operation fails checkbox. The method to merge all bodies can be very beneficial for simplification use cases. Based on the merged result, you can, for example, use the remove feature to quickly remove voids or inner volumes with openings. In the shown example, the voids are removed using a seat and boundary selection, choosing the same inner surface as seat surface and as boundary surface. This will automatically select all surfaces of the void for usage in the flexible modeling remove feature. Similarly, you could remove inner volumes with openings using seed and boundary selection rules, or you could use the internal volume feature to identify inner volumes for solidification. Note that legacy shrink wrap features regenerate as before and are upgraded to the new version when you edit their definition. Creo 11 allows fast and easier collection of part and assembly geometry for creating simplified models, envelopes, or conceptual design.